Dreams of becoming a teacher were cut short for a Pine Island Academy Extended Day staffer. Haley Price was just 20 years old when she died this week. News for Jack's reporter Janice Harris spoke with a young woman's family today. Janice. The family is heartbroken, but they say they are also very proud of the young lady they raised that was loved and loved so many people and made a difference in their lives. 20 year old Haley Price had dreams of becoming a school teacher, but that dream was cut short after she passed away from a heart attack. Price's mother told me she knew her daughter was making a difference, but felt that difference from the outpouring of support since her daughter passed away. She found the love of teaching. She would do summer camps, and then when she found the, the job at Extended Day, that's when she knew that she wanted to be a teacher. Doctors found a hole in Price's heart when she was a child. After a successful surgery, she continued with life. Like any other loving teen, she loved her family and friends. She was an amazing, amazing person. I could have asked for a better daughter. Price had thought of many careers, from nursing to law, but being a teacher won out over all the other dream jobs. This week, the St. John's County School District sent out this note to parents and students at Pine Island Academy, where Price worked, saying in part, It is with a sad and heavy heart I send you this letter. Miss Haley Price, assistant extended day director, passed away unexpectedly. Counselors have been on staff to help the students and staff mourn. A tough time for all. To know as a mom that she reached so many lives and touched so many means the world to me. That knows that she left a legacy here. Haley Price may have only been 20 years old, but her mom says she left the world a better place, especially for children. And she was pursuing that degree to become a teacher at St. John's at the St. John's River Community College. In addition to that, in her memory, her family is raising money for a memorial. You can find a link to that if you'd like with this story on our website. It is for the American Heart Association. Reporting live, Janice Harris, Channel 4, The Local Station.